Hello everyone! Welcome back to my Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky Let's Play. This is episode 2 and we will get right into it. So, let's do this. Let's see if I still manage to do the controls. There we go! And it did save, so that's good. Yes! Chapter 2. The New Re Guild Recruits This is Wigglytuff's guild. To form an exploration team, you need to register your team here. Then you have to train until you become a first-rate exploration team. Yikes! Isn't this place just a little bit odd? It just is! No, I've got Yam with me this time. I have to be brave. Pokemon detected. Pokemon detected. Whose footprint? Whose footprint? The footprint is Welpix's. The footprint is Welpix's. I'm probably mixing up who says what, but... You, you know what I'm going for, right? So... Wah! No, I can't lose it now. You may enter. Someone's with you. So get that stranger to stand up there. I, I, I think they mean you, Yam. They said to stand up here. Uh, there's a grate covering the hole. It's made so that no one can fall through. Still, it's really strange. It looks like it will tickle my feet or... Uh, hey, you, stranger, get on the grate. Hey. Pokemon detected. Pokemon detected. Whose footprint? Whose footprint? The footprint is... The footprint is... Um, what's the matter? Sentry. Sentry? What's wrong, Sentry Diglett? Um, uh... Maybe I was right. <laughs> Who's who? <laughs> it's been a while. It's been a while. Yes. Um, the footprint is... Uh, maybe Pikachu's. Maybe Pikachu's. What? Maybe? But, but it, it's not a footprint that you normally see around here. Ugh. That's pretty crummy. Checking the footprints of Wizard and Pokemon. That's your job, isn't it, Diglett? Yes, but I don't know what I don't know. Yeah. What? Are they arguing? Sorry to make you wait. Ugh. Well, it's true that you don't see any Pikachu in this part, but well, you don't seem to be bad. Okay, good enough. Enter! Oh, yipes! Yipes. That's cute. I'm so nervous. So jittery. But I'm glad we're finally allowed in. My heart's pounding though. Anyway, let's go. I hope my louder voice isn't too loud. It probably is. Well, we will see. There's a hatch that leads underground here. Yes, there is. Wow! So this is Wigglytuff's guild. There are sure a lot of Pokemon here. Do they all belong to the exploration teams? Excuse me. Ah, okay. Oh, what kind of voice are you doing? It was you two that just came in, right? Yes! I'm Chattered. Oh, do I have to sing this? I'm Chattered. I'm the Pokemon in the know around these parts. I'm Guildmaster Wigglytuff's right hand Pokemon. Now, chew! Leave the premises. We have no time for salespeople or silly surveys. Off you go, if you please. 
<laughs> no, that's not why we're here. We want to form an exploration team. So we came here. We want to get proper training as an exploration team. W what? Exploration team? It's rare to see a kid like this one to apprentice at the guild. Especially given how hard our training is. Surely the steady stream of Pokemon that run away from our rigorous training proves how true that is. Uh, excuse me? Is the exploration team training that harsh? Yeah, what? Uh, well, well, no, 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 no. It's not true in the slightest. Our training program for exploration teams is as easy as can be. Well, well, well. <laughs> I wish you had told me up front that you wanted to be an exploration team. <laughs> uh, what a shift in attitude. Okay, let's get your team signed up right away. Follow me. La, 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 la. Oh, anything wrong? Come on, over here. Oh, quickly, please. This is the guild's second underground floor. This is mainly where the apprentices work. Team registration is this way. Come along, please. Wow, we're two floors under the floors under the ground, but you can see outside. Oh please, hush now. The guild is built into the side of a cliff. It's only natural that you would be able to see outside. Oh, true. Now, here we are at Guildmaster Wigglytuff's chamber. On no account, I repeat, on no account should you be discourages to our Guildmaster. You know, Guildmaster, it's Chetot. I'm coming in. Guildmaster, I present to you two Pokemon who wish to join our guild as apprentices. G guildmaster, um, Guildmaster? Hiya! I'm Wigglytuff. I'm the guild's Guildmaster. You want to form an exploration team? Then let's go for it! First, we must register your exploration team's name. So tell me your team's name. Oh, our team's name. Uh, I didn't think about a team name. Uh, so, so what do you think would be a good name for us, Yam? Yeah, no. Is that? Yeah. So since Kala says she wanted to explore history and legends and ruin... Well, wait. <laughs> I should be better at typing. And, well, old tales and lore. So I thought Team Lore might be a good name. So that is what we're going for, Team Lore. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. Lore? Team Lore? I like it. It's a good name. It's perfect for us. All settled then. I'll register your team as law. Registering, registering, all registered. Yum ta! Congratulations! From now on, you're an official exploration team. I present you with this in commemoration. Wigglytuff set down an a Pokemon exploration team kit. A uh, Pokemon exploration team kit? Yep, it's what every exploration team needs. Open it up. Kala opened the Pokemon Exploration Team Kit. There was an Explorer Badge inside. And a Wonder Map. And a Treasure Bag. Yes! There are all sorts of great items in here! That's your Explorer Badge. It's your official team identification. And there's the Wonder Map, which is a wonder of convenience. Finally, there's a Treasure Bag. It lets you carry items you find in dungeons. Your success as an exploration team can lead to bigger and bigger space for your treasure bag. It's a very wonderful bag. Have a peek inside your treasure bag. <laughs> Weird an intonation, but whatever. Color peered into the treasure bag. The <laughs> The French Five band was inside. No. Think 
band, I guess. A lime bow was also inside. Those two items are special. I'm sure they will help you on your adventures. Th thank you. We'll do our best. Yep. But you're only apprenticing now, right now. So do your best to train. We will. Let's always do our best, Yam. Mm-hmm. Yay! Aw, room. This is your room. Yay! We get beds! You will live here while you work for us. Things will start getting busy for you tomorrow. So rise early and start living up to, your co to our code. Don't stay up late. Get to sleep early tonight. That is all. <laughs> sorry, sorry, I love this game. I'm so sorry. Aw, this is cute. Say, are you still awake, Yam? My heart's been racing all day. But I'm glad I finally forced myself to come here. I thought Wigglytuff would be kind of scary. But he was pretty nice. We'll experience all sorts of new stuff starting tomorrow, but I'm not very frightened. Actually, I can't wait to find out what new adventures are in store for us. I'm getting a little sleepy. Let's give it our all tomorrow. Okay, Yam. Um, sleep tight. <sighs> Um, now I'm suddenly apprenticing at the guild. I gotta admit, it's pretty exciting to be in an exploration team. And it's fun to be friends with Kala. But first things first, who am I? How did I turn into a Pokemon? How did I end up unconscious on that beach? I'm feeling sleepy too. Well, thinking about it won't help right now. I'd better focus on the guild's work for now. If I do that, well, everything should become clear eventually. I'll surely get to the bottom of this in time. Hmm. Yes, indeed. But we're not done yet. Saving can't hurt, though. Exploration team, quick tip. I probably don't need it. Yes. We can save now. Bells. Right. You're right, that was inconvenient. But there is another spa uh, save spot. Hey! Hey there! Rise and shine! Look! My head is pounding! What a ridiculously loud voice! It, it almost blasted my eardrums. Why are you still asleep? Wake up! Uh, my poor ears! Come on, snap out of it! I'm Laudred, and I'm a fellow apprentice. If you're late for our morning briefing, you'll be sorry, so move it! Guildmaster Wigglytuff has got a big temper if you make him lose it. Yowie, that would be one scary scene. I've got goosebumps just thinking about it. Jeesh. So anyway, I'm not about to get in trouble because you rookies got up late. So get in gear. <laughs> I read that let's get in the car for a second. Uh, my ears are still ringing. What did he say? Something about getting ready. Ah, er, oh yeah. We signed up as apprentices at Wigglytuff's Guild. That's right. But that means, wah, we overslept. Come on, Yum. You're late, rookies. Hush. Your voice is ridiculously loud. Oomph. Everyone seems to be present. Very well. Let us conduct our morning address. Guildmaster, the guild is in full attendance. Thank you, Guildmaster. Please address the crew. Mm. 
Psst. Guildmaster Wigglytuff never ceases to amaze me. Yeah, you got that right. Yup. Looks like he's wide awake. Yeek! His eyes are open, but he's fast asleep. Thank you, sir. We all value your words of wisdom. <laughs> okay, Pokemon, take our Guildmaster's words of wisdom to heart. Finally, let's not forget our morning cheers all together now. Uh, one, uh, two, uh, one, two, three. One, don't shirk work. Two, run away and pay. Three, smiles go for miles. Okay, Pokemon, get to work. Hooray! Smiles go for miles. It's really cute, though. Yay, I can move. Hallelujah. So, let's, let's. Hey, you shouldn't be wandering around there. You two come here. Aw, oh, man. I wanted to talk to people. All right. Missions. Dungeons. You're just beginners. We'll have you start off with this assignment. This is the job bulletin board. Pokemon from various regions post job requests here. You're aware that bad Pokemon are cropping up in greater numbers, right? Yep. Because the flow of time is getting messed up. It's wrecking ha havoc, right? Wreaking? Wreaking? Wreaking havoc, yes. Which is why lots of bad Pokemon are appearing. The flow of time is getting messed up. That's messed up. Time? As in hours and minutes? Do they mean something has gone wrong with time here? And because of that, more and more bad Pokemon are popping up? What's going on here? Precisely. Time getting out of whack has caused an outbreak of bad Pokemon. Perhaps because of all that, we have noticed an increase in the number of jobs. In addition, and it's unknown if this is because of time's influence, there has also been a mass outbreak of uh, mystery dungeons. Mystery dungeons? So, yeah. You know how we got my relic fragment back yesterday? The place where we found it was a mystery dungeon. A mystery dungeon changes each time you go into it. There's a different layout and different items every time you enter. If you faint in the middle of a dungeon, you lose half your money. You can even lose half your items or more. Finally, you get kicked right out. They are very strange places. But every time you go inside one, there are always new things to discover. Really are fantastic places to go explore. Well, you're quite informed, aren't you? That makes things much easier for me to explain. Jobs all take place in mystery dungeons. So, let's look for a job that you should perform. Ah, yes. Maybe this will do. Oh, really? Let's read it. Hello. My name's Spoink. An outlaw has run off with my most prized possession, my precious pearl. That pearl is life itself, to me. Like, literally, it, it literally is. This is scary. I just can't seem to settle down if that pearl is not my, in the proper place upon my head. But I've heard my pearl has been sighted. It's said to be on a rocky bluff, but this bluff is reported to be extremely unsafe. I could never go somewhere so frightening. Oh, friendly readers, w would you be so kind as to go to the bluff and get my pearl? I beg your help, exploration team members. From Spoink. Wait a second. We're going to fetch an item that someone dropped? I'd rather go on a bigger adventure than that. I'd rather look for treasure or explore unknown places. Things like that. Hush! Yikes! It's important that you rookies pay your dues. Now pay attention. I repeat the warning. warnings again to make sure they stick. You'll be forced out of a dungeon and sent back here if either of you faints. You'll lose half your money. And you could lose half your items or more. So you best be careful. Yeah, we know, we know. If you've understood all that, I suggest that you get on with the job. Um, that's life for you, honey. This must be the bluff's entrance. 
Spunk's mission description said the pearl is deep down on the B7F level. It's supposedly very dangerous. Let's be really careful. Let's do our best, Yam. Good. And I am... Um, yes, we can hold items. I will do all this and speed it up. So, see you when we're through with the dungeon. Spying's pearl. Quick, let's take it back. Th thank you. This pearl must be popped in my head, you see. I missed it so much. I just couldn't settle down without it up there. So I was just boing and spraying everywhere. That's good. You need that to, to live. Like, urgently. That's why I'm covered in dings and bums. But, but, but thank you. That long nightmare is over. Oh, I can't decide on a voice for that. You have my sincere thanks. Yang's team was rewarded with a protein. You also received a calcium. You also received an iron. The treasure bag is full. Would you like to throw away an item in the treasure bag? Oh, okay. Epidemidem. I should, mm, 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 the, the, don't I have an oren berry? What does it do? A food item that deals damage. It also somewhat fills the Pokemon's belly. It deals dam. Uh, yeah, it's too dangerous. Yes. You were also given two thousand money. <laughs> Incredible. Oh, uh, what? Wow. 2,000? We can have all this money? Of course, of course. It's nothing compared to my pearls value. Farewell. Uh, we're rich, Yam. All of a sudden, we're rich. Well done, team. Now, hand that money over, if you please. Excuse me? Sorry, that was my timer. Excuse me? Most of the money from jobs goes to the guild master, you see. And your team's share of the money comes out this much. Huh? We keep only 200? That's not fair. Well, that's the guild's rule. You simply have to accept it. Uh, um, Everyone... Thanks for waiting. I had a good voice for her. I finished making dinner. Come on, dinner's on. Yeah, yeah, woo, food, yeah. Crunch, munch, chew, chew, chew. No, no, I'm not doing this. This is 
even worse in German, trust me. Ah, I'm done eating. Excellent meal. I'm stuffed. Now I'm getting sleepy. Yep, I'm off to bed. Good night, gang. Good night. Say, Yam, today was pretty hectic with everything we went to, wasn't it? But I'm glad our first job turned out so well. I was really mad about how Wigglytuff's skill took most of the money. That's just the cost of training, I guess. You can't do anything about it. But what made me really happy today, though, was getting thanked by Spoink. <sighs> I'm getting sleepy. I'm going to sleep. Let's try our best again tomorrow. Sleep tight, yeah. Do I get the opportunity? Oh, okay. Um, I will... Okay, chapter three. The scream. But, um, yeah, I will end it off here. Thank you for watching. And... See you in the next episode.